Hey everyone, it's Ron in Vancouver at Tired Iron. I have uh, made a couple videos. Oops, my uh, the Matrix was real. I'm a three and a half volt battery one. I've got that reading twice, and then I've got two and a half volts more often. Occasionally, I get next to nothing, zero point one two something like that. A more normal reading. Um, what's today? Let's see. The anonymous march was. A couple days ago, 5th, 6th, 7th, say it's the 7th? No, say it's the 6th. Today is the 6th of November. I'm back here at the corner of my bench. Same thing I had before. This is a copper rod. My friend who's a welder told me that that's used for arc. Not like arc welding, maybe arc cutting. Some sort of plasma arc. Big, heavy copper rod. This, the negative lead to my fluke meter. This is a very nice meter. It's not the one that's going to give me errored readings. I've just got a brand new batteries in it. And uh, I mean, look at, look at the meter. I'm not touching the leads. I'm not even touching it. Every time I get close to it, it starts to rise. Now, static electricity would normally build on your clothes or on your shoes. You would be released, like you touch somebody, it shocks them. You touch a doorknob, it shocks you. That kind of thing. Um, this is not static electricity. The voltages are not nearly high enough, and the consistency of it is here. I grabbed I grabbed this lead to pick it up to put it in the copper rod over here, and I got a 0.247. Let's see what happens, huh? Copper rod. There's the wire running over here. Alrighty, y'all. Here, I'm going to hang this around my neck, maybe, like I did at the march. See if... Yeah. Okay. Check it out. Can you see that? There's our meter. Here's the lead. 5.4 5.5 volts AC. Nothing. 5.5. Nothing. 5.5. And you want to get even weirder? Check this out. See, I've got my 5.5 reading. Here's how I can prove it's not static. I'm going to touch the table. And as you see, the table is steel topped. The vise is bolted to it. The copper rod's into there. I'm going to short out the circuit by touching the table. Watch. Drops to 0 0.0, almost gone, 0 0.8, 0 0.07, 0 0.06. If I push really hard on the table and dropping it next to nothing, but I let go of the table, 5.5, 5.5, 5 5.5. I guess my next experiment, let's take this off again. My next experiment is going to have to be to find a small light bulb from a flashlight and turn off all of these lights, hold it in my hand, touch it to that rod and see if it lights up because by my estimations I should be able to run a flashlight just by touching it. What is going on? <laughs> 